So this video is how to make the Bassani Road Rage louder. So this is the standard baffle that came in it. I uh, removed it, took out the wrapping, this is way too quiet, but then I ended up losing some low end power. So to get that back, I ended up calling the, the guy there at Bassani, he recommended to uh, actually use the quiet baffle. Turns out if you take the quiet baffle and remove all the wrapping on it, just has extra wrapping that's what makes it quieter but you keep a lot of the low end because the uh, inner diameter is narrower so instead of buying one of those I decided to go with a big city thunder baffle so the monster baffle I put this in uh, one of my bikes on the Vance and Hines it creates a low roar so we'll see what it does in this pipe I'm gonna have to piece it it together with the baffle and cut some of the baffle off but I'll uh, show you guys how I do that so let's listen to how it sounds right now this also isn't a standard uh, this is a 2016 Dyna Lowrider S, but it has stage 4, 117 in it. But uh, let's try to get some of that low end back. So after a lot of trying different stuff with the baffles, cutting it, uh, putting it in different spots, I actually had two of them. I put one right here, and I put one right here. This thing had so much back pressure going to it, it tore the baffle out right out of where I put a hole in the pre-existing baffle what I did is I just basically cut it all off except for the end cap right there which actually keeps a lot of the performance in there uh, before I did that I just had the baffle itself the thunder monster in there and it was just obnoxiously loud it was like I'm an asshole loud you know like it was just way too ridiculous so I changed it now it's just got one that's right in here and it still had so much back pressure to it I actually had to add drill another hole in the uh, muffler and add another bolt because this would just slide off the back here I mean most bikes probably won't have a problem with that because um, like I said before this is a 117 stage 4 performance engine so it's got a lot of power but it sounds really nice Took it out for a test ride when the uh, baffle was actually staying in place. And um, it sounds really monstrous on D-cell. It's got a really cool sound when you do that. And it's basically like having straight pipes, but with your, you keep the performance. It's basically what these things do. Um, kept a lot of the power. Uh, I mean, first ride... I took off, it was a little bit on dirt, so I was doing lane splitting to the front of the light, and then it you know, did a uh, burnout, and then I hit one in the second gear, and then I did a wheelie without loading up the clutch. So, uh, it doesn't normally do that, but this thing's got a lot of power, let's check it out. <laughs> 